Hi and welcome to Quirky Books with Katie. Today I'm going to be doing my summer TBR video. So I am really bad with making TBRs. I do not stick to them at all, but I have made a list kind of throughout the year of books that I'll see and I'll say, oh, I'll read that during the summer. I'll read that during the summer. And the list has kind of accumulated. So these are the books that I plan to read in the summer. I am trying to get through all of them. I'm not sure if I will or not yet, so I'm going to get started. The first book that I want to read during the summer is To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee. This book is about slavery and racism, I think. I don't really know what it's about, which is sad, and this is one of the classics that I've always really wanted to read, but I haven't really gotten a chance to. Next, I plan on reading The Kite Runner by Khaled Hosseini. This book is about Afghanistan, and this is actually one of my required summer reading books for AP English, and I am really excited to read it. And last but not least on my list of classics for the summer is Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen. I have previously read Pride and Prejudice, which is one of my all-time favorite classics, and Persuasion by Jane Austen, so this is next up in my list. If I don't read this one, I will try and read Emma. Next, I want to reread Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. This is just one of my favorite books of all time. It takes place in Paris. It's a romance. And the last book in this kind of like companion novel series is called Isla and the Happily Ever After and that comes out in August so I want to reread this before I read Isla. But next, there are two fantasy series that I want to binge read. The first one is, I think it's called the Seven Realms series by Cinda Williams Shima. I have read the first book, The Demon King, already, and the books that I own in the series are the second one, The Exiled Queen, and the third one, The Grey Wolf Throne. And these are fantasy novels told in a dual point of view. There are two main characters. One is Han Alistair, who is kind of a magician, and the other is Princess Reza, who is the princess of the kingdom. And I love the first book in the series, and I can't wait to binge read these. The next fantasy series that I want to binge read is the Shadow and Bone series by Lee Bardugo. I have already read the first book, Shadow and Bone, but I read it a year ago and can't really remember it. All I know is that I liked it. This is a fantasy series set in kind of like an alternate Russia, and the main character's name is Alina, and she can control light. And the second book in this series is Siege and Storm, and the third book, Ruin and Rising, comes out very soon, so I'm very excited to read this awesome fantasy series. Next we have another reread, and that is Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell. This is the story of a girl named Kath, and she is at college, and she kind of has to adjust to her college life, but Kath is a fan fiction writer. And I really want to reread this because I will be a senior in high school next year, which is really scary. And this book is about college, so I kind of want to read this to kind of keep my eyes focused on the prize and learn more about the college experience. Next series that I want to read is also a reread, and that is the Summer I Turned Pretty series by Jenny Han. This series consists of the Summer I Turned Pretty, We'll Always Have Summer, and It's Not Summer Without You. And this is just the perfect beach read. It's about a girl named Belly, and she goes to this beach house with her family and her mom's best friend's family every summer, and they have two boys, Jeremiah and Conrad, that both are kind of in love with Belly. So this has a love triangle in it, but it's just such a cute, amazing series, and I plan on rereading these books when I am at the beach. The next book that I want to read is Forbidden by Tabitha Suzuma. This is a very emotional contemporary, and it is very kind of like, not really debated, but it has incest in it, which I know is like a touchy topic for some people. But I just heard that this book is a really emotional contemporary, and I cannot wait to read it. And the last book on my summer TBR is Crown of Midnight by Sarah J. Moss. Yes, I have already read this. And I am just, I really liked this book the first time around, but I, re I read it too fast and I didn't catch a lot of the details. And the third book, Air of Fire, comes out on September 2nd. So much excite. And I just want to reread this before that book comes out. And I am just so jealous of anyone that has an arc of Air of Fire because I would give an arm or a leg to have an arc of that book. 
So if you have read any of these books, let me know in the comments down below, or if there are any of these books that you want to see reviews of, or just let me know what you plan on reading in the summer. So thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, and I'll talk to you again soon.